How to use crop tool in Photoshop. If you want to use crop tool or you want to crop the, an image, go to this icon. If you hover over it, it will give you a, a short uh, overview of the tool. In order to use it, you can right click and choose the crop tool. Since uh, it is the default icon, so you can just click on it and it will give you the icon the function also you can right click and click on this and it will show this crop selection in order to crop it you can resize this or click and drag to crop certain part of the image so you can also move the image Let's say I want to move it here. I want to crop this. You can click check or press enter and it will crop the image. Press Ctrl Z to cancel the crop. Now we will try the other option. You can crop the image by holding the shift and it will resize it proportionally from the left top to the bottom. Also, if you want, if you hold shift and crop it from here, it will do the same, but in the other opposite way. And also you can do it this way. You can press out to crop it this way. Press out also like this. Can drop, press or cancel. You can press shift out to crop it from the center point. So you want to crop like this and click check or press enter. So that's how you can crop from the center. Let's say you want to crop also. Let's say we want to center this corner. You can straighten this by by clicking on straight straighten click the stra straighten then create a straighten line and click check so it will straighten based on the selection you can add also borders when you crop let's say you crop the image and you can pre press shift out to add a border since the red background is activated we are going to change the background color and click on this to make it default so it will be white and click from here and down and create a border and say also it is press alt to So you have this uh, background background of white or border of white. Once you crop your image also, you can press ESC to cancel the crop. Or if you want to crop and, and you want to revert it to classic mode, you can press P and move the image or move the selection in, in another other way in, or reposition it and press P again to revert it back and you can move it like that, the selection. You can change also these uh, grid lines or the overlay from here, click on this and you can always, by default it, it's always show overlay. You can remove this by clicking on the never show overlay so it will never show. So when you crop, it's not there or you can click auto show overlay. So when whenever you crop, it will just show the overlay. So let's cancel that. That's uh, another way. Let's say you want to create the other purpose of a uh, crop tool is you can also create a, a let, let's say you want to create a collage photo, you can use the crop tool and expand the canvas to this 
also to the top and click check and you can drag an, another image to your uh, to work, to your Photoshop workspace and you can put it here and the other image let's say this one check this first to place it there and drag this another image say you want to make a collage photo like this so expand this to create more space let's say you want to create a collage photo like this and click check that's another trick for crop tool you can play around with this uh, crop tool and let's say you want to create this collage photos you can also expand if you want to add more photo or revert it back you can crop it that way you can also click on the crop tool and create say crop tool click on the crop tool and manually create a crop let's say you want to crop this and select and you can crop that and save that particular image if you if you want to crop that way press ctrl z to revert it back so that's how you use crop tool in photoshop cc also it will work also in uh, older version of photoshop like photoshop cs6 and all in other older version so i hope this video tutorial helps you don't forget to like and subscribe thank you for watching